Hi guys, it's Chris. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, today I'm going to be doing Last Chance Monday and because my husband and my son told me that in their opinion, if the palette works out, it's not really a lose. It's kind of a win because you made the palette work. Anyway, we're going to try this time, and I'm going to be using the one I talked about, very last one we did, the Millennial Pinks by Melt Cosmetics. I had problems with this one from the very beginning. I, if I show you, you can you see how it looks like these are all the shim shimmers or shit satins? They're all hard pan, maybe not this one, but that's what it looks like. That's what I found. It, it seemed like they were pressed so hard that they couldn't come out of the pan. So, that's what I'm going to be doing. I did want to say that I have all the names now for the brushes, so that's closed. Everybody that was interested is on the list and um, as soon as I haven't even started separating yet I might wait for Kathy to come down here and help me so you know as I said I, I will let y'all know um, the other thing was on Friday when I do what makes you happy I would like to read what people wrote about what makes them happy if you do not want me to read your name or even what you wrote, please let me know. And I won't. I, I just think that everybody wrote something pretty much different and it was so good. So let me know. If you don't want me to include you, um, I will not. And I'll remind y'all again maybe on Wednesday. So... Here we go. I'm. <laughs> I, I yeah. You know I don't like putting bad eye looks for you guys. So this one is gonna be a real. Yeah, you see that I'm pretty much done up in pink. Maybe too much pink. I tried to. Maybe I'll put a little bit more. I used the House Labs to kind of tone down. I used the. Uh, I have to say it's a hybrid lip oil and tint. Um, but let me put a little bit more on so that maybe I won't like be so pink for you guys. Okay, welcome to all the new uh, subscribers. I don't, um, I seriously love makeup, but we do other things on here. We have a great community. And I don't always get things right, and that that happens. That's the way it happens. So let's see. I'm not sure that toned it down any, but maybe just a little. I just didn't think going completely different would would work out. We'll see. We'll see what I can do with the eyes and I, this one, yeah, it might get the best of me. I will admit. Okay. And be warned, I'm not going to put a time like rush rush I, if well, anyway, we'll see what happens. And I don't know about you guys. Hold on just a second. Whoa. Maybe that's a little better. It seemed like it was like... <sighs> okay. Okay. I am going to go into pink leather, which is this one. It, wow. It's this one right here. It looks like this one didn't want to come up either. I am going to go ahead and go for the persona which I don't know what it is I'm assuming it's a shadow brush this is the one that came out of the uh, color theory yeah which 
I enjoyed, but apparently nobody else did. <laughs> I was noticing. Oh my goodness. I don't know. I should have done this in front of you. This is like really super powdery. Oh no, 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 no. I used a MAC paint pot in Painterly. And apparently, this is not liking it. If I can get the shadow down first. Oh my goodness. But I also set my face with Rare Beauty. Um, and I don't think it likes that either. Oh, it's been a long time since I've used this because it's, it's my least favorite of any of the Melt palettes. So... All right, that's finally covered. Uh, this is like, I don't know if I can get close enough for you to see how powdery that is. Maybe this, I don't know if you can see that, but it's pretty bad. Melt it always is powdery, but this is way beyond what they normally are. And you see the, uh, on the others, uh, I don't mind that, but this is like, First you have the ones that are so hard you cannot move them and then you have some of the, uh, well, there's one, two, three, there's five mats and they don't want to move. Let's say it again. You guys all know I hate, like looking back at some of my past uh, misadventures which look do yourself a favor don't look anything up that's old it's it's horrific it might damage you for the rest of your life um but i don't like putting out bad eye looks so i'm really gonna try but these these look so okay in Okay, there's two that don't look like they've been used at all, and for some reason, let me wipe it off so I can see what they are. Okay, a black looks like it's called Euphoria, and the one next to it, which ha it has sparkles in it, it says GF. Maybe girlfriend? I don't know. It's probably not even remotely close to that. All right. Um, I don't know if I want to. Okay, modern love. That's what I'm going to go into next. This one here. Now, since I had the most problems with the shimmers, I'm just going to call them. I am going to uh, definitely start using them next. But I'm not going to use this brush. Let me get this, you know, in the corner in the crease and then we'll see what happens because these are just they look terrible okay I'm still in modern love I'm kind of interested to know if any of you did buy that Mario palette the neutrals that's been everywhere and is definitely not for me but um, did anyone buy that? And if you did, is it as good as everybody raves about? Or is pe are people just following what other people are doing? I'm just kind of curious. Because when something like that comes up, it seems like everybody is saying stuff about it. And it's just like if you want to watch videos, you want to watch something that's not the same all the time. At least that's me. God, I sound grumpy today, don't I? I'm really not grumpy. I don't know what the problem is. Maybe it's because I know what's coming <laughs> in this palette. Okay, let's see. For some reason, well, this eye is more wrinkly than this eye. And uh, I have a harder time getting shadow on it. And since I'm holding this, I can't hold my eye back, which you're really not, I, I've heard you're not supposed to do. I've done it a lot. Maybe that's why this side is so wrinkly. Uh, it's still not as dark as... Okay, let me keep going. Yeah, we finally getting... Yeah, we're getting some pigment. 
Wow, guys. I don't know what to say about this. I'm trying. I don't know if you can see it. This side, I just put like one or two swipes and it's pigmented. This side, I've like been doing the uh, windshield wiper. My, my windshield should be clean by this time. It's, it's not working out very good. Now I've got to... Alright. Okay. I am going to try and go into Ruby Spar. have no clue, but it's this one right here. And I'm not even sure if I should let's see what happens when I try try and swatch or use my finger. Well, see now this one looks like it might not be too bad. Okay, where do I want to put it? I guess right here. Okay, I got like ball out out the wazoo. So See if I can. That worked pretty. That that particular one, except for the fact that I have a lot of fallout. Okay, you guys must have some kind of magical powers because this one was looked just as well. Maybe not just as hard as the other ones, but pretty hard in the pan. So let's see what happens here. Lots of fallout, but pretty on the lid. I didn't, I didn't bake or anything because I really wasn't expecting to be able to use any of the shadows. What are you guys doing? Are you <laughs> okay? I am gonna try and go into pink noise to go up here and see pink noise is. Uh, this one right here. Do you guys have any of you? Do you like Melt? Have you used Melt Cosmetics? Uh, what's this one? Uh, this is a Sigma blending brush. You know what? Let me just try my finger because that seemed to work on the. I don't know if you are going to be able to see what happens. What's happening with the shadows? It, they're kind of bunching up. I mean, but there comes my dog. Okay, this one. Yeah, it don't look so good. I might have to. I don't know if, that, if you can see the. Okay, it went on part of it, but let me take a, uh, this is a, either a doe color or a dew color, I can't, I don't know how to pronounce it, and let me try that. It's not bunching up as much as it did with the fingers, so, oh, it worked much better seems like with the the actual brush and, and and I'm not using any spray on this so I am getting that feeling that I've gotten with every single one of these that I've done with you guys you know that feeling what is going on? I don't, I do not understand. I'm just blending out a little bit. I went a little bit too psycho with the uh, sort of shiny white, whatever that is. Yeah, okay. All right, maybe I should do this one too. You're gonna, you probably don't believe me on any of the ones that I've talked about. 
Okay, we got to get to a pink here because uh, we got pink going on everywhere else. So, mixed emotions, it looks like that would come next. That is this one here, and hopefully you can see it. Um, I'm going to use a brush since it seems to work better. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put it right here. It might or might not go. I don't know. Hmm. That's not looking so hot. We'll see what happens. I just don't want to talk about it right now. <laughs> nope. It, this one is flaky. And I, I haven't looked at my under eye in a while to see if it's really super bad or what. Okay, it's not going on really, at least that I can see, like pigmented. I don't know if it is for you guys. It's very bright on my screen, so I'm having trouble even seeing what you guys are seeing. Okay. I mean, it, it, whatever the shadow is coming out as it's going on very smooth, it is, uh, the chunkiness is there. Um, but it appears that the shadow is uh, going on. Alright. Now I'm going to just switch, uh, get the uh, brush a little bit clean here because I don't want to use the other ones on this particular one. Okay, I'm going to go into Rosé Brunch, which is this one. Let me see. This one right here. Yeah, there you can. It seems like some of these may have some shifts in color, like there's a blue down here. <sighs> well, did you see that? I have spark. I am sparkling. All right. Okay. Yeah, this one. Well. Okay. I'm gonna take. I have no idea what this is. I, I don't know. We got them in. Oh wait. It says it's a crease brush from Moda. Okay. Do I want to use that? No, I do not. I'm going to go back to the Packer Brush from Lovecraft Beauty. We also got these in, I think, the Icon Box. So, And I'm going to go into Euphoria, which is this one down here. And we will see. Uh, this one has never been used, so I can't even tell. It's so black, I can't even tell if it's on the... Oh, it's there. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Okay. Well, I just may have made a mistake. But I'm going to put it in each and then get out the blending brush. Let me just... Okay. I'm now going to take the uh, motor brush. And this was just way, way, way too much black. Okay, guys. This is <laughs> this is what we've got right now. Uh, I w I'm getting close to being done because this is... Alright, let me... I, I, the black does not want to come off. If you make a boo-boo like I did... It's very difficult to get off. Okay, I, I'm again going to put some of the Ruby Spar just to replace the uh, black that I put on there. But I'm going to use a brush this time instead of my finger. Whoa, gosh. Just got to be a happy medium here somewhere. Oh wow, it comes out way darker when you do that. And I'm also going to have to replace the 
mixed emotions, which I had the pink one, rose, orange, that one right there. And I'm using the same persona brush on all of them, cleaning them off and cleaning it off in between. Like I've said before, you can't see it, but there's something in my lap. I'm not wiping it on my pants, but again, I'm in my pajama pants, so I literally could, and it would not make a difference. Alright. Now, oh my goodness, now I have to figure out what to do with the bottom. Okay, well, you know, we don't have, I, I'm going to go into this, I love this looking color, if I can get everything else that's been coming out, so I'm going to go into this, because I think it's really super pretty, but I am going to use an essence, now, this is the mistake I made. I ordered two of them. One of them is there in the giveaway in the package. This is an eyebrow brush, but that's not what I use it for. I use it for lining, and it's wonderful. So, if you get, if you're the one when I have a new giveaway that gets that brush, just know it's wonderful for lining. Hmm. Okay, this one. It's giving me trouble. And it won't even with my finger. Yeah, this this one is not coming up at all. This is I don't know see, see how patchy that is. Uh, let's see. I hate to do this, but I'm gonna you know, take off some of the top layer. That's the only thing that I know to do. Oh goodness, there's a hair on my brush. I'm going to show you guys what's in my lap after I'm done so you can see. Hmm. This, this one is uh, an absolute fail, this color here. And I'm, I'm trying, but it is extremely patchy and it does not look like um, what the color looks like in the pan. I'm going to put another color underneath here with it because, I mean, well it is shining. Okay, we did not go into mixed emotions, I don't think. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with the dark ones on this one. Uh, we them. I'm going to go into mixed... If we did, I can't remember, but we're going to go into mixed emotions. Let's just right here. This one is coming off just fine. So, so far, the only one that I have had trouble with is the one that looks like it would be so pretty. And it's... Yeah. Okay, guys. I am gonna... Um, I've got the shadows that I'm going to put on my face on my face. So, I'm going to go off camera and put my mascara on and add one thing and hopefully it won't look quite as bad as I think it does. So, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, hmm. I am super duper sparkly. I'm going to try and show you this. I don't know if you're going to be able to see all the flying around fallout that's on there. It's covered. I don't know. And, uh, I don't know if you can see everything that's on my, this is what's in my lap. Um, 
that's pretty bad. That is not like the normal, normal melt. Even though I love melt. They're, one, they're in my top five. Um, I did add an eyeliner. The uh, Urban Decay's 24-7 Sabbath is the name of it. Um, and I used Rare Beauty Mascara. So, this is the look. Alright guys, tell me what you think. Um, I also, has anyone else used the Millennial Pinks palette? Do, and if you have, what do you think? Did you, do you still have it? Are you able, are, are they as hard as this one or as flaky as this one? Um, could this have been an old palette that I got? That might be my other thing, but just let me know. Um, anyway, I guess that's it. I just had those few things that, oh, the other thing is, is I do have part of my Sephora haul in, but I have three more packages to come in so and this is just me please tell me in the comment section if this is okay I would rather wait for all of them to come in and do it all at once maybe not the last one because they're having shipping issues where you're having to wait forever but at least two of them are supposed to be delivered today and it's the last one that I'm not sure that I should wait for because that one I don't have a date on yet so let me know in the comments section uh, do you want me to wait for that last one which I think it only has two items in it so it's, it's up to you guys anyway thank you so much for being here um, to everybody that's new thank you um, yeah and wherever you are I hope you are well Take care, have some fun, stay safe, watch your surroundings, you guys know, and I will see you on the next video. Bye guys.